Now it's time to get started with my paprika chicken shish kebabs using the Lilydale free range thigh fillet. One of the most versatile cuts of chicken, I think it is so good, particularly over some coals. So we got the coals nice and hot here. The Everdure is fired up. The Cube 360 is a cracker little barbecue for something like this. You're on the beach, you're down at the park, even just at home on the back deck, spot on. So we're gonna get started first of all with our marinade. Now, I'm gonna do something a little bit differently here. So I've got an onion and a couple of cloves of garlic and I've got a box grater. And what I'm gonna do is actually grate the onion. And the aim here is to actually get the juice from the onion and the juice from the garlic, getting that aroma, that flavor from the liquid of the onion and garlic. So there goes our onion. And I'll just flip it around and I'll do the, the garlic on the finer side. Doesn't matter if there's a few chunks in there because we're not actually going to use that sort of pulp. Happy days. And what I'm gonna do is just add a pinch of salt to this. As we know, salt dehydrates and pulls that water out. And that's what we want. So I'm gonna bring it all together in my hands and just squeeze it out. Look at all that liquid. That is the flavor right there. That is good. So save that little ball of goodness, keep it for later on. We've got some sweet paprika some tomato paste, ground cumin, some turmeric, and then I'm just gonna finish off with the rest of that salt as well. Yogurt. Yogurt is great because it sort of tenderizes the meat. We've got some of our squeaky gate all rounder. Great for something like this when you're marinating. And then just a fresh grind of pepper as well. And you'll see once I mix this together, the yogurt, the turmeric is just gonna bring out the most Amazing color, look at that. The color on this dressing is unreal. So we've got our Lilydale free range. So I'm just gonna swap that out for some that I've had ready here. I love the thigh fillet because it's got all the different crevices and parts of the meat that just can soak up all that delicious marinade. And I feel it's just so good for the charcoal. The grill just gets in there. Oh, don't be afraid to use your hands here. Now I'm gonna cook these basically straight away. I've got a really nice big skewer that fits perfectly across the cube, skewering on a little pickled sort of padron pepper on one skewer. Now it might seem a little bit weird, but we're gonna go three skewers per thigh and we're gonna keep them whole. So I'm just gonna go through and then back up and through. And that's one side. So I'm gonna get another pepper, another skewer. It's messy work, but I've got a big ocean there that I can wash my hands in. So I'm gonna go through, another skewer, another pepper. Through it goes. And then we're gonna go through, on with another chicken thigh. And just to finish it off, I'm gonna grab another couple of peppers to top that off. How good do they look? They are juicy, delicious, and they're gonna be even better once I pop them over these charcoal. Look at that. Just spread them out nice and evenly and you can see the chicken sort of hanging down and just dripping onto those coals. It'll start flaring up a little bit of smoke. See, there it is. That little bit of smoke adds so much flavor. There it is again. That's what we want. That fire and smoke has really started to kiss the chicken and Wait till you see this. Oh yeah, it's like it's been in the tandoor. It is so good. You see the charry little bits and pieces on there. That is the flavor that I'm talking about. These are done and looking absolutely amazing. I'm just gonna rest them. I got a little bit of sumac. I'm just gonna sprinkle over the top there. That is looking Special. Okay, I'm just gonna grab the grill of our cube, pop that in there. And I've got a little pot. I'm gonna pop in some of our Western Star original salted butter. So, so good. Just let that do its thing. It's gonna melt away gently. All right, the butter is looking melted. I'm just gonna pop that there. We've got our flatbreads. They're not gonna take long. 
gonna pop a couple on. Just sort of just gotta warm through. I don't want too much char on there. First couple are done. They can go down. Just a little brush of our butter. A little bit of sumac into the yogurt. Give it a nice tang. Mix that around. Dollop on there. Rocket goes on. How good. Time to pull one of these off. What you can do is just get your knife and cut it sort of through the middle. Just pop off a couple of these pieces of chicken shish. And holy shish, this is absolutely juicy, delicious. It's hot straight off the barbecue. Mmm. Oh, that's good. That is so tasty. I'm very, very happy with that. 